One of the most important things you can put on your website is your address and even a map that directs people to your location. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a custom directions map using the Web Starts Map app. To get started, log into your account and click on Edit Site. Once the page editor loads, be sure to choose whatever page you want to display your contact information on is selected. That is frequently going to be your contact page. If you already have a map on the page, you can edit its properties simply by double clicking on it. If you haven't yet added a map to your page, click Add and choose Map. Click on the Directions tab and then enter a start location. Your start location is going to be a landmark or central place that you think people can at least find so they can follow the route directions back to your place of business. So for this example, I'm using Tampa, Florida. It's just the pin drop is in the center of Tampa. Next, enter your business location into the end location field. Then choose whether you want those units to be in miles or kilometers. That's going to depend on where you are in the world probably. And then how people are going to get there. Driving will be the most common, but you could also choose walking, bicycling, public transit, or even flying. And then you could choose whether you want that route to be economical, uh, meaning without tolls. When you're ready, click the route button, and that's going to create that route. So here you can see from the center of Tampa to the address that I entered, it's going to take about 57 minutes and be 26.5 miles. Down here in the last box, you can choose whether you want to display your map in the satellite view or in the regular map view. And then you can choose to zoom in and zoom out by sliding this slider back and forth. When you're ready, click Insert Map, and that map is added to your page. You can then drag that map where you'd like it to appear and you can use the handles to resize the map however you would like. As always, when you're happy with your end result, be sure to click Save to save and publish those changes to the web and then click View Site to see what that looks like on your live website. So there you have it, creating a directions map with the Google Maps app in Web Starts. Don't forget to visit webstarts.com to create your very own free website and also see more helpful videos like this.